So we just arrived in uh, Saraselka. We've got our sleds all set up. Well, as much as we can. How are you feeling? Uh, my nose running. <laughs> it's going to be lots of that. And we're at the start of the trails. So, yeah. Then I've got to find a place to camp for the night. And have fun with lunch and dinner. Oh yeah, lunch and dinner. Number one priority. Bercha. Mm. Bercha. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh. It's like a duck with this. It's <laughs> our so, uh, first night. We had a bit of a rough time setting up camp in this ridiculously soft, powdery sugar snow. But uh, we're here, just about. <laughs> so, morning of camp one. And yeah, good weather. A little bit of snow. But pretty near to the ski tracks. And uh, we're heading off to Kyubopa pretty soon once we've got everything set up. So good morning and welcome to our crib. Uh, it's not very adventurous. Storage, lots of storage. Welcome to the kitchen. It's fairly basic but it does what we need. More storage. Inside we have a very Ospoli Bercha. Hey, I'm working. <laughs> Just packing up, getting ready for a big ski today. Skin ski. Oh, hopefully it won't be too many hills. And yeah, looking good today. A bit snowy, and uh, the sun's hopefully going to come up at some point. We had a very long time day today. What do you reckon, Mercha? I reckon we're here for now. Oh. But, yeah. <laughs> yeah, long day. Yeah, but we got to a hut. Uh, this is Nilampa, I believe. Yep. Pretty sure. But cool view. We're kind of on a mountain. It's very windy, so I'm glad we don't have to camp tonight. But yeah, these sleds. I'm pretty heavy dragging it up. You can just kind of see where we were climbing up today. But there's a fire going inside. Looks like we're by ourselves and no one else turns up. But yeah. By the way. What? It's Valentine's Day. Oh it is Valentine's Day! The guy told us. Yeah. So we would forget. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day, babe. Hey Veronica. Hey. How you doing? I'm uh We're in a blizzard on top of a hill. Headed to a uh, rouse lamp. Up those hills. How 
you doing, Veronica? Skiing well? Yeah, it's uh, heavy pokes, but it's really beautiful. And no one around, just us. We haven't seen anyone today. It's not too cold. A bit windy, but we're managing. Cooking dinner. Don't know what it's going to be yet. <laughs> it might be cheesy couscous, and maybe I found some stuffing. Oh. Oh. I, know. Oh. I know. Pretty exciting. So dinner soon. Uh, with a pretty good view. I'm pretty happy about this. Some sun. It's been pretty cloudy all day. So, yeah. Well, we're here uh, on a lake at one of our Where's this camp five maybe? I'm not quite sure. Here by the route to Lampy Huts. And uh, cooking breakfast. It's moderately cold. It's about so you can see that minus twelve. Something like that. And yeah. Cooking some water for breakfast. Veronica's pretty excited about some mango porridge. And then yeah, we'll be heading off today into the wilderness, apparently. So after a nice long day of skiing yesterday, we arrived here at Lankuyavi, this hut here on the lake, a little lake behind the trees. And uh, as usual, I'm boiling lots of snow. It's a really nice sunrise. The clouds are going. I'm trying to keep my toes warm. It's about minus 22. Check my thermometer this morning. We've got the stove going around here. Got our bags. This is the main hut. This is the tourist place and the reserved place. My little stove area. Lankuyavi, as you can see. Luskies. And yeah, we're gonna go for a little bit of a hike today. 
and then start heading back towards Saraselka. Hello. Hi Jack, how you doing? Alright. Yeah? Enjoying? Yeah, good ski today. Let's get your frozen beard. <laughs> yeah, it was a bit chilly this morning. But uh almost at campsite. About like I don't know one kilometer. Oh. So, temperature's dropped, as you can see, it's about minus 31, we had minus 32 just a minute ago. And we're out here, cooking dinner, got the stove going just about, it took a while. Chris goes is cooking, and yeah, it's going to be a frosty night tonight. But it's one of our first clear sky nights, so we may see, possibly, the aurora, if we're lucky. Trying to stay warm, Veronica's inside, lucky, <laughs> and yeah, let's see what tonight brings. Well, after our cold snap last night, going to bed about minus 32. I guess a warm front of humid air came in. We woke up to some freezing fog, which is uh, clearing now. The sun's come up. It's got a little camp there. And yeah, it's about minus 19 now. It's really pretty. It looks like another clear day. We're having a rest day in the hut. Veronica's uh, foot's not so good, a bit sore, so we're going to play some cards, have some fun, and yeah, enjoy the sights. Got a nice fire going, so take it easy. Before heading back onto Sarasoka up that way. So how is it doing in this beautiful day? It's nice, it's quite warm today. Yes, yeah. How warm were you tonight? I mean last night. Too warm. <laughs> yeah, our equipment was doing its job. I think. Did you have to vent your sleeping bag? I had to vent everything. <sighs> yeah, and how many degrees was below zero? I don't know, maybe minus 15 in the tent. But I was more worried about the thing. The thing? What thing? The thing. Oh, the digging and sniffing thing around the tent? The mysterious noises around our tent. Oh, which yeah. Could have been the human in the hut? Or was it a wolf? Or was it just a rabbit or the wind? Who knows? 
But we will never know. We will never know. But uh, we survived, which is the main thing. But only just. Maybe the thing chose to let us live because we have pure hearts. Yes, that's who we are, yes. Yeah. Well, it's not much gana uh, gas in the canister, so it's pretty empty. Be smashed of it now already. And it's cold. We might get it lit. Oh, wow. So, let's get up from Rautalampi through Nulampi. We got to the, uh, I forget how it's called. Rumakuru hut. We'll probably hang around here tonight and head back to South Selka tomorrow. So, last day of skiing. How do you feel about returning to civilization? Sad panda, nobody wants to go back. Aww. Aww. Even though it's cold out here it's and you have to cold. eat couscous every night. It's not cold and we had loads of cheese yesterday. Uh, no judgment. Well, head back up that path soon. And, uh, well, we've still got one more camp to do so you can have a bit more couscous. <laughs> You're awesome. Yeah, I know you love it. So, yeah, we'll be saying goodbye to this hut soon just after breakfast and. Goodbye. Did you see well? Yeah. Yeah. But somebody was making me get out of the bed today. Who was it? Well, you can't stay in there forever, Veronica. Well, I can. If, if mm. it wouldn't be you. Hmm. Hmm. So, about to fly out of Evalo Airport. Let's do a final weather check. Yeah, probably good way going on a warm plane. Not camping again tonight. Pretty cold. Ready for some more hot showers. Goodbye Finland, goodbye the cold. <laughs>